How many of you have had this scenario where maybe you've laid down, you have a cold, and you kind of, and then that phlegm ends up in the back of your throat? <laughs> Do you swallow it? Hey docs, I've got a cold. I'm always sniffling. I've got mucus coming down into my stomach. So my question is, is it healthy to swallow that mucus or should I always blow it out? Interesting question. Mm -hmm. And you know, talking about the cold and the flu, of course you're gonna get the sniffles, but you do not want to have a nose that is draining. Oh. Like, <laughs> that is draining. That's a bad case. Pass that over. Wow. There we go. Yeah. That, I need, I need, here you go. <laughs> but the little hair cells we have in our nose are pushing mucus back towards mm -hmm. the throat. So it's natural for it to go that way. It's going to go down in the hypopharynx, so-called post-nasal drip. That's how a cold leads to bronchitis, because some of that may get into the airway. But as it's sitting there, you feel it, you swallow it. It's not going to go into your airway. It's going to go into your esophagus, pass into your stomach. Your stomach digests it. It's not going to hurt you. Actually, let me think about this. I just thought about this for the first time. Viruses have proteins. So if you swallow it, it's a little, done. some it's extra protein. A little protein. <laughs> but, I like to give my protein. But seriously, that's how <laughs> the anatomy of the nose is designed to push everything back. And so it's fine back. to swallow it, mm -hmm. right? It is fine to swallow, but at the same time, yeah. for what wants to or drip out, it up and spit it out. A, a gentle little blow is okay too.